this ultrasound study is regarding the prostate retention of urine is the complaint and what we see is that this is the urinary bladder in longitudinal section and you can see the prostate this is the prostate gland and uh, that of uh, 69 years old male and uh, you see that uh, this is the urinary bladder the walls are not thick and uh, the in the intestinal <coughs> section you see this area well, this is the enlarged median lobe protruding into the posterior wall of the urinary bladder in longitudinal section. This is the transfer section and in transfer section you can again see a global area which is the uh, measuring approximately 13.8 millimeters protruding into the posterior wall of the urinary bladder and this is the uh, this is the uh, enlarged median lobe of the prostate. This is the seminal vesicle in transfer section. Now, uh, this is a post maturation. Uh, patient uh, was sent for maturation, and then uh, now a post maturation volume we can see is raised above norm, and the prostate measures approximately. 4.1 2 .8, 4 .2. So the total volume is up to 24 gram which is within normal. Now the cause of this uh, urinary barrier outlet obstruction in this patient is the enlarged median lobe. Now and the, if the median lobe is enlarged there is enough to cause the uh, retention of urine and uh, lead to urinary bladder outlet obstruction or hematuria. So this is benign appearing, appearance is benign though and the post maturation is the volume is raised up to <coughs> Two thirty-one ml and normal should not be more than fifty. So this is a case of uh, enlarged median lobe of the prostate with otherwise normal dimensions of the prostate in longitudinal and transfer section. And uh, the cause of urinary bladder outlet obstruction is this <coughs> enlarged median lobe of the prostate intending into the urinary bladder with the uh, right kidney. It's seen normal and uh, the left kidney is also showing no pathology. So both kidneys are normal, thank you very much.